basically what I'm gonna do is so I'm gonna throw three and a half grams uh, uh, of this apple fritter that we did a hash extraction of that was washed, same flour. Um, we're just gonna see what the, the rosin, you know, flour to uh, rosin extraction is, what the yield is on it. The hash we're getting 75% back on. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna, uh, got Daniel here, he's gonna test the actual flour, run through the, the uh, Sage Analytics test machine. And then we're also going to test the rosin that came back out of this uh, flour. We're gonna test the hash rosin, which is here. It's beautiful, we've been dabbing off it, obviously, but it's just really nice stuff. And then we're gonna test the rosin that John was making. That's a little uh, more shattery to see where that's at um, all at once. So um, that's what we're gonna run through the machine here. But first, before we do any tests, we're gonna do this smash real quick and uh, throw it in the IQ. It's one three and a half gram bag um, and 650. Okay, and probably go two minutes. All you gotta do with the IQ is lift the plates to the height of the bag. Do that by just hitting the arrow right here on the screen, up or down. Or piece of parchment paper in, throw the bag in. Big stems in that too. I wonder if I want to double that. The thing, if you guys don't think you have something right, take it out. The flour is a little dry, so I'm just doubling parchment. In case we have a stem that pokes through or something like that. And we put our parchment back between there, separate it out. We can just hit the start button and proceed. Put a magnet on it. It's all set up here, three and a half gram bag size, so that's the surface area. Um, two minutes. So basically what it's doing is applying pressure once it reaches the 650 material PSI the timer's going to start clicking off um, for two minutes and then once the timer's done the plates will release and the extraction will be done. It'll be all the rosin out of the flour. So stay tuned. Now look at this. What the fuck? That's what you'd expect to see from something that's a greenhouse or something like yeah. that. And it's it's, it's a squirter. Not bad. No, and it's there's a lot of it. It's not it's a big okay. yield, so so let's see what the yield is at least first. This is the this is your choice. You want this? Or that. <laughs> it's hard to go back what you had at a hash, you know? Yeah, and I think his 90 microns is gonna be okay too, all the way down to his whatever is 40 or whatever. It's probably gonna be okay. So total is 25%. Well, that's pretty good. And we're also gonna test the hash, correct? Yeah. Yeah, that's great. We've never done the hash before, actually, so this would be kind of fun. Oh, no shit. Oh, yeah. That's cool. We never run it through here, huh? No, not, not hash. Raws and all kinds oh. of, mm -hmm. even, even, even uh, hemp stuff, but never, I don't think, actual yeah. hash. Oh, here, we uh, else. here we go. Okay, Bronco, who you looking for now? Well, wow, this stuff is thick. Mm. Uh, he was just looking at... So it covers the whole circle. Yep. Yeah, no spaces, no air gaps. You want it to be all in there. So, okay, at this point. Okay. Bronco. Bronco, just a different head. Bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I don't want to do it. Oh, do it. Okay. Let's see what we got here. 67%. It's not okay. So it's look at how much THCA this is. This is a lot of unactivated. This is this is not. I mean, he may be burning, you know, having a high temperature, but there's a lot here that's not converted. That's unactivated. You can see it. Interesting. Yeah.
That's the total was how much? Now you have a turp profile, you have butter, you have oh my god. Look at that. What's the difference of the worth? Oh yeah. It's huge. Stupid, huh? That's that though, it's really close. It is. I, I, I think, you know, you just mentioned the turp, file, turp, turp profile, that sort of thing. That, mm -hmm. that really adds a lot to the flavor and the effects of... The effects? Yeah. What makes it so nice. Interesting. So you're a little bit higher THC content on it. Not much, but mm -hmm. it's a completely different animal. Oh, yeah, for sure. What the fuck? Yeah, the concentration process is just a further refinement. You're getting that more pure, more, you know, just the cannabinoids, the terpenes, nothing else you don't want, no yeah. plant material. 100%, yeah. So anyway, there you have it, guys. You know, so you have the flower test, you know, uh, 23 uh, or 25 or something like that. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the hash tested at 42. Um, and then the rosin tested somewhere in the 60s. Um, along the way, right? Right. Yeah. So all pretty consistent all along the way. Um, uh, just a further refinement, like you're talking about. Exactly. Yeah. The other thing we'll do is we're going to isolate some of the same stuff, and then we'll do a test on that as well. Okay. So we're going to do that in the next few days um, for you guys, so you can see that and see the difference. But you know, I'd expect that to be like 85 percent, right? Sure. Something like that. Exactly. Yeah. Six or something like that. Yep. So it'll be in the high 80s or mid to high 80s. Um, uh, it's just further refinement. So, and you can do it all solvently, solventlessly with heat and pressure, measuring the surface area and the time. Um, all done in the next measure IQ. Makes it super easy. Yeah. Anything else, camera guy? Oh, hey guys, if you haven't seen the uh, last video that we did on the hash extraction, um, check it out. Uh, what's the name of that camera guy? How to on the IQ. So bubble bubble hash, how to on the IQ. Um, check that out on the on the YouTube channel, guys. Great video. It's it's kicking off hard. So. Uh, make sure to tune in and check that out. It's a whole process from start to finish. Um, taking some good, taking this, material. actually this material, all that we just tested here, um, and taking the actual hash, you know, how to measure the surface area, how to package it, how to screen it, um, and how to refine uh, the hash from flour into this. I'm showing you guys that, but it's beautiful material. It hits yeah. you with turps, yeah, it's, yeah, it's stony as hell. Really nice, really nice material. So anyhow, what you can do with refinement. So right. um, till next time, anything you got for him, Daniel? No. Subscribe, like, make sure you ring that, ring that bell, oh, right? Yeah, ring that bell. All right, guys, till next time. Peace.